If you've ever tried finding a product source on eBay and got stuck wondering where it came from, you're not alone. Every dropshipper knows that sourcing is one of the most critical parts of the business and sometimes the hardest. But here's the question. When it comes to uncovering hidden product suppliers, which tool actually helps you uncover them better? ChatGPT AI or Google Lens? Well, in this video, I'm putting both tools to the test using real eBay listings. We'll compare them head to head from accuracy, speed, and ease of use and see which one gives dropshippers the biggest advantage. So if you've ever wondered how to find what your competitors are trying to hide, stick around because by the end of this video, you'll know exactly which tool to use to uncover those high profit, low competition products that can skyrocket your eBay business today. So let's get started. Let's start by understanding when you'll actually need to put in a bit of manual work and use free visual search tools like ChatGPT, AI, or Google Lens in your eBay product research process. Most of the time, you can easily find the source of almost any eBay product using the Item Finder, a tool inside Zeek Analytics that combines textual and visual search technology to cross-reference listings from suppliers like Amazon, Walmart, AliExpress, and more, bringing you exact or similar matches instantly. However, there are some sellers who take things one step further. They intentionally hide their product sources by changing titles, photos, or packaging details. And when that happens, even advanced tools like the Item Finder may struggle to find a match. But here's the good news. These are actually the best opportunities you can find because products that are hard to trace usually mean higher profit margins and lower competition. So in this video, we'll uncover how using visual search tools like ChatGPT AI and Google Lens can help you reveal what your competitors are trying to hide and determine which tool works best for uncovering hidden suppliers and sourcing opportunities. Now, let me show you a great way to test ChatGPT AI and Google Lens side by side and see which one actually performs better when it comes to uncovering hidden product sources. For this, I'll use my favorite tools inside Zeek Analytics, the bulk scanner. This tool automatically divides any seller's listings into three sourcing categories exact match, which are products found with the same supplier match. Then we have similar match, which are close variations of the same item. And third, not found items, products with no sourcing match detected. These not found products are where the real opportunities hide and where we'll test both ChatGPT AI and Google Lens. So let's start by finding a competitor who's dropshipping with the same model I'm using, sourcing from Amazon and selling on eBay.com. Inside the Market Insights dashboard, I'll set my filters to selling platform, eBay.com, seller type, dropshipper, supplier, Amazon.com. Now I will look at the trending dropshippers list that, by the way, updates every 24 hours. Each of these are verified sellers that Zeke identified as sourcing their products from Amazon. So let's pick one for the test. For example, this Amazon dropshipper named Sewunk Sales. I'll click on the seller's name and hit scan all items to analyze their entire product catalog. Once the scan is complete, I'll click view scanned items, which takes us straight to the bulk scanner. And here we go. I can now see all the seller's products neatly divided by exact, similar, and not found matches. Now this is where the fun begins. We're going to focus especially on the not found items because these are the listings that traditional tools couldn't source. And that's where we'll put ChatGPT AI and Google Lens to the real test. Okay, before we jump into the actual comparison, if you're enjoying this video so far, make sure to give it a like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps us grow and bring more data-driven content like this. And if you wanna use the same product research tools I'm using in this video to uncover hidden eBay opportunities, you can start using Zeek Analytics today. 
Okay, so let's take a look at some of the products we found under the not found items section. Now, these are the listings that couldn't be automatically sourced and are perfect for testing both tools. So let's start with this one. Cadoodles Pretty in Petite Hard Makeup Case. I can see that this sold 11 times on eBay in the past seven days. So we're clearly looking at a winning item with proven demand. Now let's see which tool, Google Lens or ChatGPT AI can help us find the supplier faster and more accurately. So we're gonna go ahead and start with Google Lens. If you're using Google Chrome, the process is super simple. All you need to do is right click on the product image and choose search image with Google Lens. Google Lens will automatically search the web and show visually similar products on the right side of your screen. From there, we can scan the results and look for an exact match from amazon.com since that's the supplier we want to source from. Now I can already see some exact matches and a few lookalikes. Here's the best part with Google Lens, you can actually filter your search by typing in the specific website you want results from. So in this case, I'll type amazon.com in the search bar and right away, there it is. We found the exact match for this product. Let's click on it and yes, it's the same Cadoodles Pretty In Petite Hard Makeup Case selling on Amazon for just $16.99 with free shipping. That means that this eBay seller is making around $3.50 of profit per sale after fees and with 11 sales in the past seven days, that's about $38.50 in weekly profit from just one small product. And here's the exciting part. This kind of item can easily sell 30 times a week once you list it yourself, mainly because most sellers skip the manual sourcing step we just did. Now that we've found the source, I'll simply copy the ASIN ASIN from Amazon and go to Zeek Analytics and reload it to complete the sourcing process. Okay, now let's repeat the same process, but this time using ChatGPT AI. So I took a screenshot of the product image and uploaded it to ChatGPT with the following prompt. Search for this image source on on amazon.com. The results came in pretty quickly, which is impressive, but here's what I noticed. The products ChatGPT found weren't an exact color match to the one I uploaded. I opened a few of the suggestions and while some of them looked similar, I could not find the exact same version of the product. The closest results I got was a similar item listed on Walmart. But again, the color and design were slightly different. So it wasn't a perfect match. So in this round, when it comes to accuracy and precision in visual matching, the clear winner is Google Lens. It found the exact product from the correct supplier while ChatGPT AI gave good alternatives but missed the perfect match. Moving on to test number two. Okay, so now I want to take this test to the extreme and see how both Google Lens and ChatGPT handle a much harder challenge. Sourcing a product that uses a real life image instead of a clean product photo. I'll go to this product here. It was sold four times in the past week. And as you can see, this image is definitely not your typical e-commerce photo. It's a more natural lifestyle image, which usually makes it harder to match across marketplaces like Amazon or Walmart. All right, let's start with the Google Lens again. I'll right click on the image and select search image with Google Lens. Let's see what happens. Wow, that was surprisingly quick and accurate. After typing amazon.com in the search bar, Google Lens immediately pulled up the exact same product from Amazon. And get this, it's selling for just $15.99. That's impressive. Even with a complex real life image, Google Lens managed to find the exact match almost instantly. Now let's do the same process, but this time with ChatGPT. I'll take the same lifestyle image and upload it with a prompt. Search for this image source on amazon.com. All right, let's see what happens. Okay, so ChatGPT did return one result, but after opening it, it's 
definitely not the same product we found earlier on eBay. And interestingly, ChatGPT even acknowledged its limitations, saying I could not identify an exact match that clearly corresponds with your specific image. So once again, the win goes to Google Lens. Yay. It not only found the exact product faster, but also sourced it accurately from Amazon, even with a real life, less traditional image. So if I were to summarize the results of this test, when it comes to product sourcing using visual search, I'd say ChatGPT still has a lot to learn from Google Lens. In both of our test scenarios, one was a standard product image and one was a lifestyle photo. Google Lens delivered exact matches quickly and accurately while ChatGPT struggled to provide the same level of precision. Google Lens found the exact product in both cases with just one click directly from the Chrome browser while ChatGPT required me to manually crop and upload the image, then type a prompt to search online. And even then it couldn't identify the correct source. So overall, Google Lens clearly wins. It's faster, more accurate, and fits much more naturally into a dropshipper's day-to-day -day workflow, making it the better choice for sourcing hidden or hard to find products efficiently. Okay, so if you found this breakdown helpful, make sure to give this video a like and subscribe to our channel for more real data-driven dropshipping experiments. And if you want to take your product research to the next level, start using ZK Analytics today. The same tool I used in this video to track competitors, find profitable listings, and spot hidden opportunities. Thanks for watching, keep learning, keep testing, and I will see you in the next video.